Well, those vaccines are vital for keeping COVID cases and symptoms to a minimum. Still, we've seen an uptick in cases, and we're seeing an uptick in vaccine clinics popping up across Hampton Roads now. 10 on your side photojournalist Robert Rizzo has that reminder on why those shots are still so important. According to the Virginia Department of Health, almost 74% of Virginians are fully vaccinated, but they're still seeing an uptick in COVID cases. At the City of Chesapeake Health Department on Tuesdays from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m., they average 30 to 40 vaccinations per clinic, and they are concerned for those still in need of the vaccination. We're certainly um, worried about the immunocompromised. Um, we're worried about those who have pre-existing medical conditions. Um, the elderly. They not only do the vaccinations at their clinic, but they also go into the community and offer vaccination at local food drives, churches and schools, and other community events. We're increasing efforts for uh, community outreach for our vaccination clinics out in town, and then we're also um, doing um, routine uh, COVID-19 vaccination clinics here in the health department. And if you are experiencing COVID-like symptoms and test positive for COVID, even with an at-home test, what should you do? Those tests, we are asking that they report those uh, test results to their uh, private uh, health care provider or to us here at the uh, Chesapeake Health Department. If you do test positive for COVID, they ask that you stay at home and isolate for at least five days from the date your symptoms began. There's always um, pockets of, um, of uh, pandemic fatigue, um, and that's certainly to be expected. Um, but we hope that people will remain vigilant if they have not yet been vaccinated, that they will get vaccinated if you're eligible.